Hi guys, I'm Kimberly Cherry with what do you know, another box. But this is a very, 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 very special box. These are the kind of boxes that I only open twice a year. <laughs> and there's a little hint sitting here. Of course, yeah, you already know it's in the box because it says so on the little thumbnail in the description. So, what am I talking about? Okay, my box came a little crushed, <laughs> which is so normal, right? That wasn't bad. H had it had anything in here other than what is in here, I, I wouldn't have even noticed the damage on the box. As it was, I knew what this was, and I'm like, oh, be still my heart. And here, okay, this is some um, Dal Chateau. Chateau, Dal Chateau. Uh, limited edition spring event Russell. Right? Pretty sure it's a spring, spring event. And Dal Chateau is the sister company to Dal Zone who created my funny little Eudora here. So they're cousins, which is why I have Eudora here. Russell is much smaller. You see how well they packed her was why I didn't freak out when this box came looking like it had 60 pounds sitting on top of it. Now I don't know whether to thank EMS for that or whether to thank USPS for that, so I'm just, I'm not going to go there. If you've been watching my channel, then you know that I go there a lot, and I'm, just, I'm not going to go there in this video. This is a neat little dolly pillow. Ooh, it's made of like velvet. I wish you could feel it. Can you see the texture? Now, one thing I have to say about these new dolls that come straight from the manufacturer is the smell of the resin is so, it's, it's not a good, it's not a bad smell. And I suppose after I collect for, you know, a decade or whatnot, it'll probably be like the smell of a new dolly. And, I, and it'll smell like, you know, heaven to me as it is. I've only been into dolls for, I guess, three. I'm going to say three years. I think it's been three years now. And this smell is still, is still kind of new to me because I don't order very many new dollies. Most of my dolls are not necessarily second hand, but they, they're, not, they're not fresh out of the factory like my event dolls have been. Okay, and she's also in her pillow wrapped very securely. The resin companies are prepared for idiotic handlers. I, I said I wouldn't go there. Cherry, don't go there. She's just not going to. Just don't. Do -do 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 -do. A little bit of hair that's been wrapped up with my with my doll here, which makes me wonder, you know, if we could clone in DNA. What type of a person would I get on this hair? I watch too much Big Bang Theory. Obviously. Yes. My baby's packed very, 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 very. Very, 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 very securely. I seriously like that securely. Though I'm like, no, we're, we're done playing. Give me my scissors because this is stupid. All right. I'm gonna have some. Oh no, I know I gotta keep unwrapping. And. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh, I don't even know how to start here. Oh my gosh, you're so funny looking. You're funny looking through the bubble wrap. I'm gonna take this bubble wrap off. And how can you breathe like that, sweetie? I'm going to free you. Set the resin baby free. Set me free. Set me free. Oh my gosh, what a funny like a little doll. I'm not going to show it to you yet until I get all the pieces off. Because I'm just going to fast forward all of this because it's very tedious. But they did. They wrapped this really, really, really well, for which I am insanely grateful. Insanely, insanely grateful. Like, not even kidding. Oh, I can just pull that off. This one too? I don't want to pull too hard. I know these bald dolls are made. And look at her little tiny legs! Okay, keep going. Okay, 
fucking pull her tail. I'm not gonna, I'm afraid I'll really pull her tail off. This kind of feels like surgery to me. And I'm no surgeon. Wow, seriously guys, I thought my Eudora was odd. My Russell is odd. I mean, I saw the pictures, I knew that she was. But you really, you don't, you really don't appreciate these art dolls, which is what I'm gonna call these guys. These are not regular ball joints dolls. Because they are not, <laughs> they are not strung like regular dolls. Like, I would be so horrified if I had to restring these dolls. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to do it. I would send her to somebody more competent than me. Here he is. And I say he, I don't know if this is, I don't know if this doll's going to be a boy or a girl. They usually tell me themselves because I will buy my dolls with genders in mind and then they get here and they go, why are you calling me he when I'm a she? Why are you calling me a she when I'm a he? There's, there's this funny little face and okay, its ears are hollow. Look at these funny little ears. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And the, her legs are like toothpicks. Oh my gosh. Her paws do not move. And the same on the back. It has a joint here at the knee, like at the front, but the paws do not. Of course, the back quarters do. And look at this funny tail. Ah, it's such a funny tail. Oh my gosh. So, here is my new stall. Yeah, seriously, I was like astounded by... This one's spindly legs, and look at how much thinner. Okay, we 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 only need to see one leg. There we go. Look at how much thinner this one is to this one. Wow. Get off. So here we go. Our little side by side. Yeah, they look like cousins. They really, really do. But oh, they're gonna go so beautiful together. They are so so. You guys are so cool. They're so cool. Last little thingy here. Let's see if we can pose this funny, 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 not pose. We're just going to try to stand it up. And I may not have the patience for that. And I may not have the camera angle for that either. You know? Stands up really well. I didn't even have to try. Eudora was not that easy to pose. Um, and I haven't really messed with her that much. Just, I, I, I thought she was cute, all splayed out like I have her, yeah. And I was so afraid that she was just going to snap and just, or not, you know, she, that her, like that, you know. So I just decided, you know what, honey, you're cute like that. You can just, you can just stay just like that and be adorable and look like you're on ice and that you fell on your booty and that was fine. And I was wondering if I was going to have to have the same mental attitude with this girl. But somehow, she stands up rather well. And I noticed I'm calling her a she, even though I think I did have it planned in my mind that this, dog was going to be a boy. I mean, his name is Russell, right? That's a boy's name. And now that I went bragging on him right away, she be it. Maybe this is her way of punishing me for calling her a boy. Uh. <laughs> oh, it's too funny. It's a funny doll. It's very unusual. I'm very happy. I'm very, very pleased. It, uh, it, it feels good. The quality is really really nice even the little spindly parts don't feel terribly fragile they don't feel as thin as they look so um and the same in like her ears and her tail she doesn't feel like some dolls you get them and you don't even want to mess with them they feel so fragile their resin feels so thin that they just feel like they're trying to waiting to break in your hand i don't really feel that way when handling and moving this funny doll around. Um, so even though it obviously does give off the appearance of being spindly and fragile and very breakable, it's it's not the feel that you get from, you know, playing around with him. Her. It. She. What? I don't know. It, it will tell me. It will tell me whether it is a boy or a girl or what it is. So if you would like to see me make this girl look a little bit more like this girl as far as her face up and blushing is concerned. Do give this video a thumbs up and I will bring that video to you guys. That is all for today and I hope that this was informative and enjoyable and that you guys are staying cool if it's hot outside. 
it's still hot outside here. I think the high was 80, but it's still too hot. Come on, fall. Hello, where are you? Or that you're staying warm if you're on the other side of the globe. And we will see you guys next time. No, that's not weird how you do. I, I would stand them up, but Maddie Gumpkin doesn't like to stand. No, she doesn't. I don't know what her name's gonna be yet. She will remain nameless for the moment. <laughs>